All right, guys, so um, if you are following our channel and you're following this, uh, you know we already installed the frame TV over there in that third unit right there. So um, I'm gonna be going back there to finish my work up tomorrow. But for today, I have Cody and Benny for the past three days while I was on my little birthday trip. I had uh, Cody and Benny working on these uh, pre-wires on this side. So yeah, I'll check it out real, here, real quick right here. These are all in construction phase. They said they've finished the first two units, so I'm just gonna walk these first two units and see how far along we are. So yeah, right here we're at garage level. Um, garage level, they're in the D-Mark, that's where the internet lines are gonna come in, so that's right there. They still gotta land a box for that, but uh, they're waiting on me to tell them exactly which location to land it in. So um, I'm gonna land that right here. That's to then bring the internet in their house. Uh, I ran a speaker, so they ran their speaker right there. So when you pull into your garage, your speaker will be right below you. So let's go check it out. So yeah, here I had them run an additional speaker right there. That's going to point down towards this stairway so you can get your through house music when you're walking up. We have our first bedroom right here. So they ran TV in the corner. That two cat five and coax to each TV. And they ran speakers there and there. That all looks great. All this wiring is running back to here, so they still have to land all of this. Because all this is actually going to run here in this closet. So this is all looking great so far. We'll land a couple boxes up high. I'm gonna put a rack mounted up there on the wall. And then yeah, let's keep walking over here. There's front door right there that entry almost always gonna be going through the garage but you have that option and uh in here they ran yeah speaker there and they missed this oh no they ran it right there they're waiting on me to tell them where to put it so that speaker wire runs there tv right there a tv and power cat5 coax perfect closet is right there and then bathroom one speaker up there so yeah let's keep walking upstairs this will be the elevator shaft which is super cool goes all the way up there to the top that's the elevator shaft there's gonna be a handrail here that goes all along the inside that will uh, wire for light up LEDs in the future if they want to add that upgrade here we are in the third story so third story in this unit, this is another secondary bedroom or office, I think in this person's case. TV's there, wired the speakers right above the bed here and here. Uh, if it's not, normally it's be a bedroom, if it's gonna be an office, they're gonna have their desk there looking out the window. Um, but here is the bathroom, additional speaker wired up in the bathroom, TV like I said. And now into the master bedroom. This is the master. So TV's wired there. They wired for some LEDs to go around that TV. That's that whole setup. And then speaker there and there above the bed. It's gonna face this way where that TV's gonna be there. And then master bathroom. We have one speaker right above the shower right here. Uh, that's actually it for this room and then I wired one speaker up in the closet. All right. And then yes, that's also another speaker for through house music. So yeah, I wanted to have this thing when you're walking up your stairs in the house and wherever you walk, you hear your music throughout your home. So that was the really cool idea that Warren and I came up with. So now the fourth floor. All right, up here on the fourth floor, we are wired for two TVs. There's one TV here for the kitchen. So they're gonna need to whip some wire around and pull that over. Actually, no, that is, there's no TV in these kitchens. That one is for the fridge and the microwave is gonna go above it actually. And then, should be 7.1 wired in here. Which looks like they haven't wired it yet. Nope. So yeah, they're gonna come back. We're gonna line 7.1 up with these cans. There's gonna be six speakers in the ceiling and one below the TV. Normally we would uh, advise against this, but 
all our clients are looking for a super clean look because these are super modern custom homes. Um, this guy, we're actually, he's the one unit we're wiring different because he may want to consider doing nine channels in here and putting like a really sleek, gloss white Martin Logan tower in here. Uh, just so we can at least get the front stage all in the front. And then a cool little bar area. Here's your elevator shaft again. It's four stories up now. So yeah, we'll go up to the very top floor. Show you the top floor view. Uh, if you guys do follow our videos, you saw on our other one on the Samsung frame mount that uh, showed you the top view from their side, but these ones are staggered about 15 feet higher. So let's check these ones out. All right. Here's the other unit. It's a breathtaking view. Considering this is in Texas, that is breathtaking. So there's that, and you have your city view. It's Frisco over there. Very cool. Yeah, and so anyways, out here we'll be doing the TV mount there. TV mount in the center. They're not opting for that, but we're still gonna wire it. And then speakers, they haven't wired yet. The speakers are gonna go up there, here, and above that one. So yeah, guys, stay tuned. We're gonna keep working on this whole pre-wire. Um, I'll show you the build out. It should be done in like six months. But uh, yeah, I'm glad I get to catch you in the uh, pre-wire phase. It's really cool to walk the pre-wires on all these houses and see them start as one thing and turn into something else. So yeah, stay tuned. Check out the rest of our channel. Like, subscribe. Thanks for watching.